the iPhone 4 is much more than a yearly money dropper. This will have a lasting impact, well, until next year, on the way we communicate with each other. In 1977, my mother gave birth to this douche with glasses. In 1989, I got my first imaginary girlfriend. In 1999, I got my first hug from a girl, my great aunt Bertha. For 2010, designing this phone has been the biggest leap forward in my life since I got a race car bed in my mother's basement last week. We're introducing the amazing cornea uh, retina display and we're bringing video calling to the world. Oh, what? To the world? To the world. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Didn't you do this with the computer application? No. Uh, um, I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, wasn't it called like iChat or something? Um, uh, I've never heard of iChat. What's that? What are you talking about? You work for the company that designed that app. Um, I think you need to go, sir. You even introduced it. Here's the picture. Uh, that's my evil twin, Hernando. Look, you see your name tag right there. Security. Oh, oh, whatever, man. The truth will find you. The truth will find you. Yeah, get him out of here. Yeah. Oh, about, about, about video calling. We're calling it FaceTime. It'll change the way you communicate with the world forever. The first time I stood in the winds of a hurricane, I was blown away. FaceTime is amazing, engaging, it's all about connecting people. My children, in three or four years, will get their unemployment card. And I can just imagine being able to call them and see their one bedroom apartment life but also to look in their eyes and to tell them that one of their contacts fell out. What's even better is that it switches from the front camera to the back camera, so your lazy face doesn't have to turn the camera around to film your kid riding a toy car. Oh, memories? Eh? That's not that big of a memory. And since AT&T is so stubborn, you'll be able to chat anywhere there's Wi-Fi. But what's amazing is that whenever Okay, I can't do this. Why is Joe just like a clown over there? Whose idea was that? Did he lose a bet? Another thing we're excited for on the new iPhone 4 is the retina display. It's the highest resolution display that is in a phone, but that's what we say. We like to stretch the truth. MacBook Air, then this notebook? Nope. Not by a long shot. You have something that looks at your eye, like your crazy stalking boyfriend. Another thing that adds to the supposed clarity is optical laminization. What is that you may ask? We don't know. We just like to run up company money on features that we think will make our phone the best. And it usually works. So all of this work put into this display is pretty much a waste of time. <clears throat> what? I'm being honest. See this nose? Ain't gonna grow. Of all this bowl, we added IPS technology and an LED backlight display, which means you can waste your battery a lot quicker now in everything that you do. The display is definitely blow away. Oh, yeah, 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 we get it, we get it. Display and away rhyme. Good for you, you graduated elementary school. Apps can now show more acne than on any other device. iPhone 4 allows multitasking on all apps. You can simply switch between applications and it's just the way you left it. If you're like me and you work for a multi-million dollar company, then you have a lot of apps. And you would like a cool way to organize them. And that's exactly what Folders does. Just simply drag one app on top of another, and it intelligently names it with apps that have nothing to do with the folder name. Mail on iPhone 4 is so hardcore. You can organize all your messages from your inboxes into one unified inbox. 
You can also organize your messages by thread. Confused yet? These fake pictures put on the iPhone 4 look amazing. And now we added LED flash, because honestly, who needs digital cameras anymore? <laughs> no way! We have our phones that have random flashlights on them to take pictures at night. Plus, the camera captures full 720p high-def video. Even though 720p is not full high-def. Why did I say that? I'm an idiot. Not only can you record supposed HD video, but you can also edit it on the overly stripped down version of iMovie for the iPhone. Behind every great phone is expensive technology. What's running this amazing software is our A4 chip. It's custom based silicon and what that gives you is remarkable speed and efficiency with a really tiny chip. We started with goals that we should have had when working with the original iPhone. We wanted to add basic phone features, like regular calling, but at the same time, we wanted to make it lighter and smaller, so it's easier to lose. I mean, I mean, use. We're so powerful and almighty as a company, we decided to make our own steel. Take that, Nietzsche! Careful, that surface is hot. The steel frame functions as the antenna but also the main structure for the phone, which is the cost for more lost service. We're also badass by designing our own custom glass that is stronger than any mortal force, but 30 times harder than Hugh Hefner. The glass is not only used on the front of the phone, but also the back. The quality materials, the precision engineering, the expensive technology will all become relevant when you're throwing down your money to buy it. Even if FaceTime was the only feature we would be releasing, we'd still get all your fanboy money. But it's the fact that we got all this useless crap- Oh, too early? It's the fact that we got all this useless crap in a thinner product. You're gonna lose all your money all over again. I can't have-